But anyway, welcome everybody, and um, I just uh, we're just going to kick it off by uh, uh, somebody's beeping. Let's see. I love what uh, we did at, co at convention. We all had the bracelets that said one team, one dream. So that uh, really just uh, really amplifies what I believe in is when it, it's one team, one dream. Is that that's how my team name is making a difference. So uh, to help everybody be able to dream bigger and to be able to uh, help them reach their goals and make a difference in their lives. So uh, we're going to kick it off real quick with uh, looking at everybody that made a difference in their business in November. And Annette Ants is going to share with us the recognition levels for those that achieved the five hundred and thousand dollar levels and earned those bonus uh, bonus for uh, for November. Annette, you want to take it away? Okay. Um, let me just ask you first. Do you hear background noise? I'm sorry. Do you hear background noise? Not anymore. I don't. Okay. Um, it looks like it was Angela's phone that was doing it but now she turned it off um okay. can i interrupt beforehand can we all like introduce ourselves since it's our first meeting you know i was going to do that but i was going to say like how are we going to go across the screen we're all different levels but we can we can definitely oh, yeah. do that. i'm retarded never mind no that's okay you know what amy i will go and i will just who i see first on the screen i'll just go across and i'll call them out and they can introduce themselves where they're from and how long they've been in the business how's that sound okay. Is that good? And Brandon, Brandon watches every time. I mean, he, he comes in. He doesn't actually watch in front of mine from uh, the nugget. Okay. I see uh, Karen first. Karen, you want to go first for us? I wish you had your phone. Karen, uh, Fort Pierce, Florida. And how long have you been in the business, Karen? I started um, at the very end of August. Awesome. So you're a newbie. Yeah. Yep. Of colors on hand and inside. Somebody's got background noise. If you can mute yourself. Might be me. I'm going to mute again. I haven't been able to have, um, have any colors. Okay. I see Pam next. Pam? On hand. But she does. Hi, everybody. I have been... Um, I was with it when it was DCD, and Teresa and I joined a month apart, so Teresa may have to input because I can't remember how long I've been in now. I want to stop on with the on-hand colors. Where are you from, Pam? Uh, well, originally I'm from Northwest Indiana, but I moved to Phoenix, Arizona this um, April. Oh, okay. Awesome. <coughs> You're welcome. Thank you. Teresa, I see you next. Cutest little stockings. I'm Teresa. I am um, also from Northwest Indiana, and I now I'm in Florida. Like Pam is in Arizona. We've all kind of ran to the southern states because we're thinking snow sucks. Anyway, um, I am um, what it does. You know it, Barb. Um, so anyway, I'm excited to be here with you girls. I couldn't be more thrilled to have been um, asked if I could please um, go underneath Miss Mercado because she is one of those leaders that has not wavered at all on all the crazy and I enjoy um, very little drama so I am thrilled to death to be here and super excited so I'm excited for our first call ladies. Awesome love you girl thank you. Teresa, Teresa I'm gonna mess your name up just say it for me. Villa Lobos. Villa Lobos. Lobos. I was living La Vida Locos when I saw your name, and I'm like, oh, "There you go." Okay, that's what I was gonna do. You're part of the Lobos, so it's <laughs> Villa Lobos. <laughs> um, Teresa the Lobos from Chicago, Illinois. Um, I I'm under Teresa Wendricks, and um, I've been with the company when it was DCD. Um, I believe it's four years now in October. Awesome. So, Excited to be working with you. Thank you. Monica, I see Monica's iPad. Yeah, hey, hey Jennifer, it's Monica Sauter. Um, <laughs> North Augusta, South Carolina. I'm one of those people that already lives in the South and we don't see much snow at all. So um, I'm a newbie. I've been, I've been a, a curator since October. And she's, she's doing great. Congratulations, Monica. I'm trying, thank you. Amy Challenger? 
I don't know. Oh, I didn't know you could ask me them. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Uh, I'm Amy Callender. I'm way up in the Pacific North, North Rish, in the Pacific Northwest in Washington State. Um, I have been in business almost four years in March, and I am also super excited to um, be with this group of women and some men, as Teresa likes to say. Um, <laughs> I was. Uh, I really wanted to. Um, align our team with some strong leaders and um, I think we've done that so I'm excited to um, I'm excited to be here. Awesome. I'm excited to Dina Clark. I apologize apparently I had something going in the background I didn't realize. Um, <laughs> like I said it's been one of those couple of days um, I'm Dina Clark. I'm in near Houston, Texas. I would tell you what little town I'm in, but you wouldn't know where that was. Um, I've been in since uh, November. I just hit my two-year mark, November 2015. Awesome. And I'm Jennifer. Oh, and y'all are going to get to know her as a computer guru for us all. So. And she works full-time, but she still does it. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> uh, Tara Rognes. Hello everyone. I am Tara Rognes. I am from North Dakota and we have plenty of snow here today. We're actually in a blizzard warning, so that's fun. Um, I have been with DCE or DCE or DCD um, since December of 2013. So I'm coming up on my four years th this month. Awesome. Glad to have you. Thanks. And that ends. Um, and that ends. Um, in Richmond, Virginia, and I've been with BCD TCE for two years. Yes, you have. Marie Gilligan. Um, I'm from Wilmington, Delaware, and I just joined this past June. And she's a rock star too. <laughs> add that all these in. Shauna? Hi, I'm Shanna. I'm from Florida. I've been with, were you talking to me or is that? No, we no I'm talking to you. I just said, I'm saying everybody's name wrong. I want y'all to all say my name without hearing it the first time. No, go ahead. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's all right. Um, I've been with the company just over two years. Awesome. Glad to be working with you. And I see uh, Lisa's iPhone. Hi, I'm Kerwish from Chicago, Illinois, and I've been in the business four years, almost five. Wow, we got some rock stars here. I'm I'm excited, y'all. This is great. I see uh, Angela's. Oh wait, Angela just sent a message. I think that was Angela. No, that was Emily. Angela's iPhone is next. Am I there? Can you hear yes. me? Yes. Okay, good. I wanted to make sure. Um, so my son, I live in Fremont, California. I've been with the company when it was DCD and TCE for three and a half years. And um, I still love it. And I have no intention of going anywhere. And um, I apologize. I'm multitasking a little bit tonight. I actually have a rehearsal right after this one in the car. That is okay, but I'm going to say so what she I'm just said, she's not going anywhere or has no problem and intentions of going where I won't go. Yes. No, that's sorry. I had to add that in. Thank you, Angela. Yeah. Barb. <laughs> Holick, is that how you say your last name? Yes, I'm the Chuckaholic. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Um, I, my name is Barb Pollock. I am in Aurora, Illinois, outside of Chicago. I count my years by conferences. So my first conference was St. Louis. So that's five years. And I'm not going anywhere. Awesome. Love it. Welcome, Barb. Uh, I see Sharon next. Uh, hello. I don't know how to do this. <laughs> I'm on here. No, I switched can, the camera. 
We can hear you. There you go. Can you see me? <laughs> I can see you now. Okay. I joined under Teresa um, back in March when it just changed over to uh, the Cocoa Exchange. So I'm here. Well, awesome. I'm at it. <laughs> We're glad to have you. Where are you from, Sharon? Oh, uh, Kentucky. Kentucky. Louisville area. Okay. Well, great. Glad to have you. Okay, Melissa. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Uh, I'm from a tiny little town called Buna, Texas, and I joined also the first of March when they just changed over to the Cocoa Exchange. Awesome. So, and Melissa's I'm, rocking her business too. And I'm just little putting little additives in here just for the ones that I know that I've been working with for a while. So we're glad to be working with you, Melissa. And Katie, Katie S is who I see. Hi. Um, Katie Swagansky, Cleveland, Ohio. Um, I joined under Teresa about a little over a year and a half ago. Um, I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I'm just picking. I, I'm excited. This is you know, this is great. I love that. You know. Where this, are you, you know, from, Katie? Uh, Cleveland, Ohio. That's awesome. My husband's sitting here in the office with me, and he's like, he knows we've been all over the map. So he's like, oh, yep, been there. So awesome. Glad to be working with you, Katie. Same here. And I see next Pam. <laughs> Pam, what are you, Jennifer? Go ahead, Pam. I already went. I'm from Phoenix. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, you're fine. The screen keeps jumping around here. Did Brenda, did you go? I see Brenda next. Okay. How about Mary W? Mary, we're introducing ourselves and we're saying where we're from. So you got on just in time. But we can't hear you. But your lips are looking great, moving. <laughs> But we can see you. Can you hear me now? Yes. yes. Okay. I'm Mary Warbird, and I'm from Chicago, Illinois, a suburb. And um, I've been with TC for about six months. Awesome. Glad to have you. Okay. I see uh, Lindsay B. Now I'm going to say that. Lindsay B. You're up next. Can we go in and check it out? Let's go. All right. You guys want to check it out? So she too just don't join. Lindsay, can you can you hear Jennifer? Lindsay, I'm here. Oh, oh good. Oh, so what you what just happened, honey, is that we are introducing ourselves. So you have to come off mute and, and say your name correctly for Jennifer because we're going to start calling her Bro Cato just until we all get it. And then we can stop making fun of her. So go ahead and introduce yourself, Lindsay. Hi, I'm Lindsay Boreas and I'm from Chicago. Awesome. And I see a 913 number, 913-378. You know, I'm going to just say this. Who hasn't uh, already uh, shared your information about where you're from and your uh, how long you've been with the company? Because seriously, people were jumping all over my screen. Well, the 913 and the 509 just came off a of mute, so why don't you guys go ahead and talk? No. No. 509 is Emily Smith, and I know that she um, had um, a, a doctor's appointment this evening, so um, she's awesome. 
and just during the summer. No, this October, uh, September. Okay, well, we're going to get started, and if anybody else comes on that wants to introduce herself later on, we will definitely do that. Again, welcome everybody, and I'm excited to be working with all of you. And you know, I was just, I was just, uh, just adding light to uh, people that were saying that they were here to stay. You know, that I, uh, I just wanted to. Uh, I know we've all been through changes before. A lot of you, before we all joined forces together, I went through a change too, and a lot of us went through changes. We lost our leaders too, but that, you know, that. Um, I just wanted to remind everybody that one person doesn't make a company. We all do, and all partnering together and working hard and uh, making our company great is the great thing. And uh, that's what that's what I'm all in for is to help all of us achieve all of our goals and uh, dreams. And I uh, I'll be sharing some information that Heather sent to me earlier too. So she wanted to be on the call, but she's actually doing a team meeting right now in Denver, Colorado. So uh, I'm for that, but. Uh, we're going to go ahead and keep going forward because so, I don't want to keep us all night. I know that Teresa and Amy are all nighters. I don't know how they do it, but they are all nighters. But Jennifer Brocato is not. So uh, anyway, we're going to go ahead and Annette Ants, can you go ahead and share the recognition for the uh, incentive earners for November, please? Um, sure. Okay. So we have for the five hundred dollar incentive level for November. We have the following: um, Renee, Al Madame. Calhoun, Madame. You get on your Westover, Monica Sauter, Samantha Harrison, uh, Debbie Hennigan, Brenda Powers, Deborah Poremba. Catherine Canada, Lisa Perkins, Heather Lumley, Kristen Cromie, 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 Lori Basson, Karen Castle, Jennifer Gear, and Kirk. Everybody, that's awesome. And I apologize if I've chopped up your name. Um, so yay. All right, so for the $1,000 VEST level earners, we have Jennifer Bacato, Catherine Swiga, Catherine S. Swignoski. Swing, Swigansky. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, Swigansky. <laughs> Gosh, I'm sorry. Um, Jeanette Hemingway, Melissa Goddard, yay, and Dina Clark, Angela Mahan, Angela Mann, um, Cheryl Fraser, Barbara Hollick, Chalkaholic. I'm never going to forget that. That's awesome. Um, Amy McKenna, Marie Gilligan, um, Annette Enns, Teresa Wendricks, Amber O'Dell, Sherry Bow, Tara Rognes, Teresa Villalobos, Mary Warburton, Shanna Morse, Victoria Han Handland, Amelia Challenger, and Susie Smith. Congra congratulations, everybody. We're all going to look sharp in our vests. Awesome. How many of y'all received your vest already? Was it the right size? Did you change it in the back office? Did you remember? I changed mine. I changed mine, but it's coming up that it's going to be a medium sent to me. That's what my sister on my one leg, or maybe an arm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I haven't received mine yet, but I know Dina received hers, and she said it's just hers was a little snug. She said, "Oh well, guess I need to lose a little bit of weight." <laughs> That's what she was saying. So, anyway, but hers, but you can wear it, Dina, right? But you just can't zip it. Yes. Okay. Oh, that's the story of my life with these damn clothes. Just no zipping. <laughs> <laughs> I hope that doesn't go for damn your good. pants, too. That's what you can tell everybody. The chocolate's too damn good. You can just tell everybody that. My clothes don't fit because the chocolate's too damn good. That's awesome. <laughs> oh, okay, I want to, uh, we're going to move forward, y'all. I want to congratulate all the leaders that were paid at title. 
That was uh, Dina Clark. And I can't remember what I said last time. Shanna, is, am I getting it right? Okay, there you go. I said it right. This memory of mine. See, getting old sucks. Shanna Morris, Teresa, Living La Vida Locus, and Amy Challender. <laughs> Myself and Teresa Wendricks all paid it title this month. So congratulations, everybody. That's awesome. And right. while we're at it, Amy and I would just like to congratulate Jennifer Brocato for promoting for the first time ever to senior manager. She's not even paying attention. We're so excited for her. We finally have a title worthy of herself. So Yay. We're exciting, ma'am. Oh, well, thanks. That's that's all because of all of y'all because we're all you're all awesome so i'm excited uh, you know sometimes i don't feel worthy but i uh just have to say that i'm very thankful and grateful and blessed and uh i can't wait to see what we all do i think we're going to just take it even higher so anyway let's keep going so sales bonus earners this is awesome i love whenever uh everybody receive you know that extra five percent ten percent or fifteen percent bonus level i mean i think we all do right isn't it great to see your checks with that bonus holy crap is that your number that you sold jennifer on this paper <laughs> <laughs> that is so exciting are you kidding me i'm doing the math right now <laughs> well i won't tell you what i already put in this month then yeah. Oh shit. Okay. So Jennifer's <laughs> check for just her own sales is one thousand nine hundred and forty-four dollars. That's just her own sales. How cool is that? Okay. So I'm sure somebody was doing that part of it, not me, but I just you know, I obviously just printed it. And I'm now just reading it. So you know, the meetings don't always go as planned if I'm on them. However, I try to behave. Oh, but okay. you add so much joy and fun and entertainment to it. I just love it. That's awesome. Yes, I reached the 15% bonus level uh, this past month with 48.60 in sales. So it was supposed to be a lot higher, but my fundraiser didn't close till today. But you know what? Just the luck of the draw because now we have triple points. <laughs> they didn't get all their fundraising orders until today. So I'm, hey, I'm okay with that. Yeah, I no know, kidding. I know, for real. So uh, putting a $4,000 fundraiser in at triple points, that's awesome. So anyway, uh, and I... Oh my gosh, that means you get to take Jay Brocato with you. Is he there? <laughs> Is he excited? Right. He's sitting right He's here. He's so saying. lucky. She's going to lose you in Mexico, honey, but I'll come find you. She's going to come find you. Well, tomorrow's Jay's birthday. And uh, I said, oh, it'll roll over tomorrow in the system, but I just earned you the trip also. Now, tell me how lucky you are. So, Happy birthday. <laughs> I said, I told him how old he was going to be. He's going to be 52 tomorrow. He goes, shut up. Don't tell anybody that. <laughs> oh. well, well, I'm glad you're listening. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's sitting right here, so he'll roll me over in his wheelchair in a little bit. So, oh, well, I'm not scared, y'all, at all. But... Uh, <laughs> 10% bonus level earner. And I promise you, I'm not really trying to mess up anybody's name. Uh, Catherine. Katie. Katie Swagonski. Well, so, oh, Katie, Katie, can you please have an easier name? I <laughs> wish I could. I'm, it's very <laughs> phonetic. Just, it, just remember it's a phonetic name. Well, I saw Swig, and I actually want to take another drink of my wine, you know, just <laughs> make it good. <laughs> uh, Katie had an awesome month. She had 24.37 in sales. So awesome job, Katie. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Way to go, girl. And we had several 5% uh, percent bonus earners. Uh, Jeanette Hemingway with 22.88 in sales. Melissa. Melissa, she, uh, y'all, I just have to tell y'all, Melissa, uh, she is just so timid and shy and just but so sweet. And she has broken out of her shell and just ran through the gate. and you know that's what I love about the business is making a difference in somebody's life and helping somebody and Melissa you're just doing awesome Melissa had uh, $2,065 in sales this past month awesome and she's still kicking butt and taking names this month in December so and Miss Dina Clark that works like 70 hours a week 1833 in sales 
Angela Mahan, I know she's on the phone in the core in California, I think. Uh, she has just been great. Also, just really taking her business, control of her business, 1738 in sales. Cheryl Frazier, 1676. Barbara, uh, what was it? Chocoholic. She had a great month also, 1650 in sales. Everybody was like engine to get up there. Uh, Amy McKenna, 1635. Marie Gilligan, 1615. And Annette Ent, 1610. Awesome job, ladies, and congratulations on your 5% bonus level that you achieved. That's awesome. Way to go, girls. Way to give yourself a raise. And you know what? I was looking at numbers from just before our teams all merged together, but my our team sales last year in November were great. But December, you know, being a shorter month with our uh, being able to get our sales in in time for Christmas, we did more in December than we did in November last year. So, with, especially with triple bonus points right now, with everybody trying to uh, earn this trip, it's going to be really uh, exciting to see what we where we end up at. I mean, we already have almost seven thousand dollars in sales. This is just December 4th, so I can't imagine what it's going to be. That's exciting. So, okay. We had uh, some sponsoring uh, divas last month, and ever, these are uh, all sponsored in one. And we're going to uh, really amp this up in 2018 because we need to be sharing more of the Coco Exchange. That's just my own personal opinion because I think that we have a lot of awesome uh, awesomeness to share with everybody. Dina Clark, Heather Lumley, Amy Challenger. And Karen Castle all welcomed one new consultant to the uh, business last month. So awesome job. Hey, Teresa, you want to uh, shout out the uh, top trip point earners for right now? Oh, I would love to. Okay, so number one is, um, oh my goodness, so this is such a lie. So Jennifer, because, you know, she's so modest, she only put the 28,451. Um, should I say her last name? I just, oh my God, I think I'm going to say it wrong for like a month because then I think that you won't feel bad, honey. You'll be like, oh, I can trash everybody's name because then Teresa will kill mine. Okay, so that means that if she put in 4000 that means that she's got another 12000 So that means Jay is really going. You're really going, big guy. So woohoo, way to earn two trips. Um, Amy has got nineteen six um, thirty-four. Um, Maria has 18897 Hey, Jay, get to go on a trip, do ya? Um, Teresa Villobos, um, 18,669. Um, Amy McKenna, 17,486. And um, Tara Rockness has 15,847. So all of those people literally could do what Jennifer just did with a fundraiser. I mean, Obviously, we would hope that we had one in the bag, but, um, and then earn either finish your trip, earn two trips. How cool is that? So just know that to me, if you're sitting at, um, so let's just talk about Jennifer did $4,860. So even if she went to work the way she did, so even if y'all went to work the way that um, Jennifer went in, and again, I'm huge on leading by example. So she's really big on that. But um, anybody who does that this month for the triple points, obviously is going to earn the trip, even if you only had 10,000. So if I didn't say your name and you're sitting there thinking literally that you cannot do it, I assure you that you can. Um, especially now that they just implemented the triple point. So do not give up um, on yourself, your dream, and what you're thinking you want to do. If Mexico is your thing, um, definitely make sure that you um, keep working towards it because it is not over until it's over. So congratulations, ladies. Way to go. Totally agree. It's not ever over. I mean, because we have got so much ground. I mean, so much time left in front of us. It's just, it's awesome. It's amazing. And I, we have like 56 days left in, to the, turn the trip. So I just remember that whenever we came on, uh, I've been with the company. I didn't even introduce myself earlier. I'm Jennifer Brocato. And uh, I... Uh, Brocato. Brocato, avocado. We've been called everything. Uh, Brocato. Let's see. I could, I could keep going on. But... Uh, and I'm from Louisiana. So... Uh, but we... I know that Dina... And Annette and myself, we all came on November 19th, 2015. And within 40 days, uh, I had earned the trip for two. 
and I was in the hospital twice whenever I earned it because I had I had cancer at the time. So um, this trip can be earned by anybody. I'm telling y'all. So don't limit yourself. Take all the limits off and shake them off right now. Do not limit yourself. I remember John calling me while I was in the hospital whenever I earned the trip for two. He's like, I know that you're under the weather right now. He said, but I want to let you know that you just earned your second ticket. He was, he was really excited. So I just want you to know that all limits are gone. Do not limit yourself. And just, we're going to hopefully uh, go full steam ahead to earn this trip. So, um, Okay, we're going to talk about incentives now that's going to help us earn the trip. So right now we have triple points. I mean, my God, you know, I uh, just, like we were talking about, I just closed this fundraiser up. Thank God it was $4,000 in sales. I thought it was going to be last month. Thank God it, the last two people didn't turn it in till, uh, today. <laughs> I got to be able to enter it today, but that's, that's awesome. I mean, there are lots of uh, people still looking for fundraisers. Talk to those people, even if it you're doing it and setting it up for, uh, you know, uh, for January for double hostess dollars. Talk to those people. Don't don't count anybody out. People are looking for things. People to make it happen in, uh, you know, even in January, at the beginning of a new year. So uh, make sure you talk to those people. Uh, we also have uh, the incentive cash bonus for team leaders that are paid at title for uh, three months consecutively. Make sure if you're a team leader and you have been paid November, if, if it started in November, make sure you hit December and January so that you can get your $300 bonus paycheck. I know that uh, I haven't looked at everybody because it's it takes a little while to go through everybody's name that's been a team leader and how many times you've been paid as a team leader. But I'm just going to use I said Dean as an example. I, um, I told Dean, I said, you got to do it. December and January, well, you still got to go. And so, uh, no, in just in December, then she earns her three hundred dollar bonus. But in Feb, in uh, January, if she does it all over again, she gets those bonus five thousand points that was offered also for the company. So I'm using her as an example. But if you have uh, hit team leader for three months, you get the uh, consecutively, you will get the three hundred dollar bonus. And if you do it for four months consecutively, when the company initiated the uh, uh, incentive, you'll get a 5,000 bonus trip point level. So uh, make sure you stay on top of your numbers. And if you uh, need some help deciphering, if you are uh, at that benchmark, talk to one of us and we can help you and find out the information for you because we don't want anybody leaving anything on the table. It's yours for the taking. So, uh, also, Jennifer, do you mind if I do a shout out with that? Go ahead, please. Um, Teresa Villalobos, um, when they announced it, went hardcore with it, and she actually will receive her paycheck um, now. She earned it three consecutive months in a row, so congratulations, madam, on doing that. And also, another thing that I would love to say to you guys is, if you are not a team leader um, and you want to be one, you still have the opportunity to do this. So, it isn't something you had to do before. You can literally start doing it this month. So if you promote to team leader this month and do it for two more consecutive months after this month, you're paid if you're a team leader and you finally get paid in title because you have been maybe missing that mark and you know that you've um, built something up that you can do it, then yes, like Jennifer said, talk to somebody, um, see if you can um, pair up with somebody because you can still get paid for it. So um, obviously I'm huge on not leaving any money on the table. If the company is willing to throw money at y'all, just get in line and put your hand out. So um, yeah, definitely just know that it's this month and it's also next month. So if you are brand new and you just joined in the last um, 30 days and you're thinking to yourself, I don't know if I could build a team, you can. And um, if you do it and you hit the mark by January um, 31st, you have January, February, and March as well. So the last time you have to hit it is in January. So please do not, again, don't give up. It's not over until it's over and the money is on the table. It's a, a nice bonus. Um, we all love like the girls that got paid in a bonus level. I mean, we all love doing the exact same work, but just making more money. It's just um, working um, smarter, not harder. So just make sure if that's something that you want, that you're reaching out to one of us because between Amy, myself, and Jennifer, we are totally here to help you figure it out and um, to keep um, egging you on to get you there. So thank you, Jennifer. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks for sharing. And for those of you that are new to the company and maybe don't know what we're talking about, Team Leader, 
it's me plus three and fifteen hundred dollars in sales and I, I love that me plus three me plus three I, I mean that is embedded in my brain me plus three fifteen hundred dollars in sales and your personal sales need to be six hundred dollars to reach that level and if you want to uh, coach more on that my door is always open for coaching so i am here for you so uh we can get you to me plus three that cash bonus level so that you can like Teresa said leave nothing on the table if the, if the money if the company is throwing us money get out there and catch it so uh we have that also so also i want to remind you about accelerate for those of you that are team leaders now it will end it at november the 30th and hopefully those of you that registered are ready to, and gearing to go to uh, accelerate and that means jersey in february i know i'm going and people are thinking, Jennifer, you're crazy for going to Jersey in February. I don't know how many people have looked at me like I was crazy with three heads when I told them I was going to Jersey. But you know what? If there's an event that is going to help me bring my business to the next level, I'm going to be there. So uh, I will be in Jersey in February, and I hope to see all of you there. If you have not reached the team leader status yet, and you really want to work for it, and you want to get there, I would love to work with you one-on-one -on -one because you still can go. If you are not a team leader now and you reach team leader in December or January, you have the opportunity to sign up and go to uh, Accelerate in Jersey, February 9th through the 11th. So get with me and we'll get you on board. And uh, Accelerate is gonna be all about just what it says, accelerating our business, taking our business to the next level, developing us as leaders even to be even stronger leaders. So I'm excited for that. And the, the bonus thing is if you uh, reach $2,000 in sales between November and December, I think it was those, those two months, and you sold $2,000 in sales in those two months, the fee that it charged you for uh, going to a conference was, I think it was $79. You'll get that money refunded back to you when you get to Jersey. Now, you don't have to wait for a paycheck. They're going to give it to you as soon as you register. So that's the great thing. So that's just a little extra money for you to go spend in New York City. And that's what I'm, I'm thinking of anyway. But anyway, uh, I hope to see all of you in Jersey in February, okay? Even if we're crazy, we can put snow boots on and all that stuff. I've lived in Alaska before, okay? If I can handle it, y'all can handle it too. But anyway, I'm excited. And uh, next up, I, I, I want to keep us rolling real quick because I don't want to keep everybody up too late for all you East Coast people. But uh, Dina Clark is gonna share with us real quick. Sorry, Dina. You still have to read off what you uh, put to, what we talked about today. Dina has not been able to finish it. She had some uh, technical difficulties. Her work was really making her work today. And then her kid, she got home and her kid was making her be a mom. So, I mean, just hurt him whenever you, whenever you see him next, Dina. No, I'm just kidding. But me and Dina have been brainstorming and uh, we work together. Dina's awesome. She's come to Lake Charles, Louisiana, and worked an event with me. I mean, it's a two and a half hour drive. Then she went to Baton Rouge a couple times last month with me, which was a four and a half hour drive. Sometimes it was six hours. But yes. she's dedicated to her business. She's dedicated to helping all of us too, especially with technical problems and stuff like that, making all kinds of graphics for us. But we really have brainstormed together about a 12 day of Christmas promotion that we could all use to help us with this uh, triple point segment that we have right now that we're in till December 15th. So Dina is going to run it by us real quick. She is working on a graphic for us to use just to give you an idea of what it is. Uh, you can use what we were putting together if you want. We are given a discount on some of the products. If you wanted to recreate it, but still use the verbiage that we're using, that's totally up to you. We're just trying to make it easy. So Dina, go for it. So I, Jennifer and I were just bouncing ideas off of each other and kind of the 12 products that we came up with were um, like the first day of Christmas would be um, cinnamon dust and almonds. Um, two turtle doves would be each with their own bag of chocolate fudge coffee. So two bags of coffee. You, if they purchase two, then they get some kind of discount. Um, three French hens. Isn't it three French hens? I have horns. See, I needed to tweak this. Um, we could do the hot sauce trio that we have in the gifting program. Four calling birds, ask them to do their favorite candy bites. They have to buy four to get the discount. Um, five golden rings. We um, talked about the chocolate bar because there's five bars in the box. Um, give a discount on a chocolate bar. 
um, six Gisa Lang, six sweet treats with the Taste of Dove signature. There's six items in that set. Um, offer them a discount on that set. Uh, seven Swans is swimming, and I just put out there that we have um, several boxes of seven pieces of different chocolates that we could give a discount on those. Um, eight maids of milking, anything that's milk chocolate, the delights of, of my heart. So you could give a discount on milk chocolate. Uh, nine ladies dancings. I figured after a couple of martinis, you'd be dancing. So, <laughs> so I figured we could do some kind of discount on chocolate martinis. Um, 10 lures of leaping. Um, we could do something with the organic granola or some of the organic products in the pure dark line. Uh, 11 Piper's Piping for any of our seasoning tins, 12 Drummer's Drumming for our ultimate appetizer gift. So those are just some of the ideas. I'm trying to put together a graphic um, and we can give ideas on, I mean, you, and there's things beyond just a little discount on all of these things. You can offer free shipping. Um, we still have the, some, they, they spend 75, they get something for free, plus they can get the peppermint, the peppermint rounds for $15. So there's other things that you can add to that and then just have a, a holiday party uh, open in your name that when you're getting these orders in, cause they'll place them through you to get the discount that you want to offer them. Then you can put that on a, a party order and you could either, you know, give some of those, that those hostess benefits out or that's the hostess benefit you can have for giving the discount to the customer. So that those are my ideas. If you have better ideas, shoot them to me. I'd be had to, we'll be glad to add whatever. Thanks, Tina. I know we have, I, I've been singing the 12 uh, days of Christmas in my head all day and, and, and Teresa's like, what are you laughing at? Because we have been working on this try and me and Dina have been laughing about it most, but whenever we got to the, uh, the ladies dancing, it was definitely the martinis. <laughs> that threw us off. But, you know, it was so funny, but you know, anything to help us, brainstorm and do and we're thinking you know it says 12 days of christmas but the flyer is going to have 12 uh, pay pieces pictures on it and they can choose what day that they want to participate and right. the deal the idea behind it is to close it all by december 15th correct even though it says the 12 days of christmas on the flyer and we're we only have 10 days till that cutoff. Yeah, we'll only have 10 days to the cutoff. So we will have it published tomorrow, right, Dina? Yes, we will. <laughs> so we've been working on but anything to help. Because that out. wine is working, right, Tina? It is. It's working. Okay, good. It's working. <laughs> but it's the idea is to help for the winos. <laughs> everybody achieve whatever level you want to be at this month. I mean, and if if you were able to get you know, two thousand dollars in sales—that's six thousand points. Look how close everybody would be closer to that trip. And then we even have January to go. And you know, the company may have said, or I'm gonna put it like Heather said, she might know and she might not know that the company is going to help us with the last part of the month too. So you know what? We have all of this month to go. So whenever I tell y'all, don't give up on this trip. Don't give up on this trip. It's so attainable. So if we can do anything to help all of us work on this trip, that's what we're here for, to help you grow your paychecks and be on that beach with us. I've been to that resort, okay? There's swimming rooms, and it's amazing. I've been, the first month it was opened, I was there. So uh, we all got to be there. So Dina, thanks for uh, sharing that with us. because You're welcome. It's great. I promise I'll work on the, the graphics, so I'll have it by tomorrow. She will. I can, I can always send a bottle of wine, so just give me an address. I don't need any more wine. <laughs> I'm, help you. I'm, just, I'm here to help you support you when you're done with it. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. I love it. Okay, so more things to help you with your, uh, uh, to make the triple points by December 15th for the trip. Make your out-of-the-box calls. Anybody that's placed an order with you recently, call them. Text them. Have you taken your product out of the box? What do you think about it? Can I give you? Can I point you in the direction of some more ideas how to use your product? Just follow up. You know what? When we go to Kroger's or Target or uh, Walmart, they don't call us and ask us about our products. Check with your these people. I mean, if you really are serious about upping your chat your paycheck this month and upping your points, make the make the time to call those people and to check on them. 
you never know, or you can even offer them something that's gonna complement the product that they've already purchased. So um, something else to trigger uh, for you to get more points this month is, you know, uh, those uh, stocking stuffer ideas. I mean, I don't know if y'all saw the little snowman ideas with the uh, bar library that somebody posted on the uh, curator page, but it was awesome. That is an awesome idea. I don't know how many bar libraries we sold this weekend because I had it on my phone and showed everybody. I'm like, oh, do y'all need Pekino gifts? Do you need teacher's gifts? And what, they were just flying off the shelf. So definitely save those pictures in your phone and show people that or put it on your Facebook or you know, send it in an email to your customers, whatever. Let me help you shop for uh, some more stocking stuffers. And then also, I don't want y'all to forget, good Lord, please don't forget, cinnamon dusted almonds. You know, they're going away after this catalog. I know people are complaining, but it's like, I tell everybody it's like crack. They've got to get it. they got to stock up. So, uh, and they also freeze well as well, as well. So, you know, the ones that, you know, that love cinnamon dusted almonds, reach out to them before the 15th and try to get those extra sales in so that you can get those triple points. So, uh, you know who your people are that love those cinnamon dusted almonds and, you know, just follow up with the customer service just to remind them that they are, uh, we are discontinuing after this catalog. So our incentive for the royalties program ends December 31st. So even though they're gonna be, they're, we're still gonna have them to the end of the catalog, the royalties program where you're gonna get a royalty check at convention, that ends December 31st. So make sure you're reaching out to those people. So now we're going to bring it to Amy Challenger. She's gonna share with us real quick about doubling down in January. Um, I actually wanted to say a quick thing about our December um, rewards this month. Um, so we have a really awesome opportunity with our um, guest spend promotion this month. And of course, I knew this was going to happen. Okay, she's coming. <laughs> Mom of the year sat in front of the TV. <laughs> okay, so... Um, um, the $75 spend promotion this month is our cashews and almonds or our sea salted cocoa caramels, which are individually wrapped. So um, one of the great things about it is that they can, and this is one of those gifts, they can divide up into smaller um, gifts for people. So get a cute little mug, put three or four of those in the mug, and that's a nice cheap gift that they got for free. Um, just for spending $75 with us. In addition to that, they added an extra kind of cool, um, you know, the fun um, Pure Dark Peppermint Rounds for just $15, which is another savings on top of that. So um, uh, guests get a lot of good freebie options this month. So make sure to um, uh, make sure to promote that when you're talking about how awesome it is um, for our $75 spend. Yeah, I just wanted to say that. Um, okay, so January is going to be double host rewards, and um, you know, um, can I hold on one second and shut the door because I feel like it's getting loud. <laughs> the day in the life of moms that work in direct sales. So that's okay. Yeah. We, that's why we do what we do. I'm just excited you had pants on that you could do that. What? <laughs> I'm just excited you had pants on that you could do that. I'm wearing jammy shorts. Well, why do you think I keep turning my crap up like this and while my children walk by? Because nobody has pants on. I they have to go from one side of the house to the other. So I just sit there going like this the whole time, <laughs> looking like I'm taking you all on a roller coaster ride, but it isn't. It's because my children don't believe in pants. <laughs> uh, okay, so. January is double host rewards, which is awesome. But one thing I always like to tell people is hold up. Do not mention double host rewards to anyone unless your December is full. And there's still a lot of opportunity to party between Christmas and New Year's. There's all kinds of fun things that you can offer people. Um, you know, there's people that don't celebrate Christmas. Um, there's leftover cookie parties where you can, you know, do like a Sunday 
you know, uh, use like leftover Christmas cookies to make fun Sundays with our stuff. There's all kinds of different ideas that you can use to get people to party between Christmas and New Year's. Um, so make sure if you have dates during those days to fill those up first before you talk about our double host reward, because obviously um, people are going to be excited about that. Um, so uh, yeah. Do I really need to say a whole lot about double host rewards? <laughs> um, make sure you book those people that may be on the fence about joining, because um, this is a fantastic month where they can earn, um, they earn their kit for just um, a five hundred dollar party. So, absolutely. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, I like to add that. Uh, you know, right now this time of year, we're doing so many vendor events too. Follow up those people that even expressed an interest, somebody that placed a big order with you. you know, follow up with those people because those people obviously love our product. So let them know like they're in a VIP group or something that you want to let them know first. I also reached back out to my hostesses that did a party the last time we did double hostess. And I'm like, oh, I've got to let you know before I tell anybody else, you get to pick your date first because my calendar is not full yet. Uh, even if I'm lying to them, you know, I'm like, you know what, you, you get to pick a date first before anybody else, just to make them feel that much more special. So reach out to those people too. Uh, you know, there's a lot of uh, people that uh, you think outside, you know, about who all the different people you are. The ones that have uh, had to cancel a party before for whatever reason it was, family emergencies, whatever, let them know that you have got the perfect opportunity for them. And going back to what Amy said about the end of December, you know, I, I have done like uh, Bunko's parties right between Christmas and New Year's where they wanted to have a New Year's celebration and they had me come in and I set up like a vendor event at their Bunko or Pequino party. So there's that opportunity also for uh, more income for December. So there's so many opportunities. Don't, uh, don't think that just because our cutoff for uh, Christmas shipping is December 15th, that we can't go out there and still party sometime in the, uh, at any other part of the month. I mean, I have a party December 18th and a party December 21st, but it's because they know that all their friends will be there if they say that they're having a wine and chocolate party. So, hey, whatever it is, I'm going to be there. But uh, <clears throat> think outside of the box. And I, Amy, thank you for uh, sharing. And Teresa, thank you for sharing. Annette, thank you. Dina, thank you. And going forward, I... Uh, I want to I want to include a lot more of, of us to be able to share our, our ideas because there are a lot of great people on our, our call right now that have great ideas and I want all of us to be able to share that so uh, I wanted to add uh, in with a note from uh, Heather Heather wanted to be on a call tonight with us but she couldn't because she had to be in Denver tonight but uh, she she's wanting to do a call uh, next Monday and it's, she's either going to do a call with me privately and we're going to record it or if her calendar is open where she can do it with everybody, she's going to do a call where we all can jump on together because she wants to do great things with us in 2018. So uh, he Heather is manning the office by herself, y'all. <laughs> she is doing a phenomenal job and she is 100% committed. And she even told corporate, she said, I know I'm supposed to be 100% corporate first. She said, but I'm 100% filled first because these people need me. And that is exactly what she's doing. So uh, if we have the call, I promise you I'll be, uh, we're supposed to talk tomorrow. But if we uh, schedule that, I will send it out as soon as I, I get back from a party tomorrow and we'll make it happen. And those of you that can be on or if you can watch the recording, whatever it be, make sure you uh, participate either by recording or on the call and uh, listen to what she has to add because she's got a lot of great information and knowledge in the direct sales industry so uh, also uh, one of the things that we talked about uh, on the list was you know making your plan for 2018 and you know I know a lot of things that happened uh, just recently with all of our businesses you know I want you to go back and reevaluate why why did you join TCE remember your why and then I, I challenge you to go back and Revisit your vision board. If you have a vision board of all the things and goals and dreams and hopes that you had for uh, your vision, I, I challenge you to go back and re revisit that. And you know, if you have to, uh, you know, rearrange some things on your vision board or add some things, take some things off, 
go back and do that, kind of like your bucket list and uh, why, why you're part of TCE and what are your goals for 2018. And once you write down what your goals are for 2018, please share them with me. I would love to know what your goals are. I, I really want to uh, set up groups within our organization to help us, maybe it be four or six people at a time, like target team groups, or we can uh, help each other. I mean, I know that when Lori was with the company long months, almost a year ago, you know, we had uh, coaching calls and those were, it really empowered people. And I would really love to see that again with, within our group, because I think, all over the, the map, we have different uh, value that we can add to each other and help us grow stronger and make us powerhouse women and men in this industry. So uh, go back and revisit your uh, goals and dreams in your vision board and uh, what your plans are for 2018. And you know, if you don't share them with me, share them with your upline manager so that we can help you uh, achieve whatever it is that you your desires of your heart is, because that's what it's all about. You know, your plan might not be as big as my plan. But what, it's whatever your plan is. That's what we want to make happen with you in 2018. I ha also had a couple of people ask me about Christmas parties and things like that. I know some of you, some people may not celebrate Christmas, and I respect all of that. And I, uh, but I just wanted to put it out there that some people had asked me, but, and we have people spread from one coast to the other, up and down, all across the world. So, uh, you know, even Alaska, we have represented in our team, but. I just wanted to offer to all of you, and uh, hopefully we're offerings on Facebook by now, and if not, you've received two emails from me today since I forgot to put the times in the, uh, the first email that I sent out, but you have my email address. So uh, we are going to, I'm offering a secret Santa for those of you that want to play, and uh, I will I want to play. You want to play? I want to play. I'm, gonna, I'm creating a spreadsheet for everybody that wants to play. Send me an email. I don't want any chocolate. No, no shot. Wine. No, I'm just teasing. Uh, and I'm going to, I'm going to set the limit as $15 because I know that, you know, you know, that might be a stretch for some people. So just to make it an even playing field, we're going to do a $15 limit for those of you that want to play. Please don't feel like you have to do this. I just know that some of the girls had asked for it, like a white elephant thing, but I'm going to, uh, I'm going to create a spreadsheet. I will send you who your person is. You won't get the same, the person that you, your name is. They won't get your name. It'll be Wait, somebody all over. Are you doing it like a white elephant thing, or is it really like a nice thing? It's gonna be a. Because it's gonna, it's gonna be a nice. Thing. It's not gonna be a gag gift. Wait, what? No gag gift. Okay, good. Cause I I want something nice. Okay. <laughs> now I'm I'm trying to get messages to boys that buy shit for me. I want something nice. I want like. You're so crazy. Okay, for those of you who want to participate, send me your uh, information, and I will include you in the spreadsheet. I will send you somebody else's name, and we're going to make, we're going to spread Christmas cheer all around the United States, and we're just going to have a fun Christmas get-together with each other, with, you know, your own secret Wait a second, though. What about you? What about me? Well, you're not going to participate? Y'all can all send me something. No, I'm just teasing. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I want to play. I want Jennifer to stop. That that was too good. I, I'm sorry. That you left that door wide open. Way open. Wide, wide open. No, I, I don't need to participate. I I can just. I'll I'll grab somebody's. I don't I'm going to send my gift to Jennifer, and then she's going to have to send it on so that y'all don't know it's from me. There you go. If you figure out it's from me, I'll send another gift. <laughs> I can even get Heather on board with this to do this. I promise you. But I thought it would be a lot of fun. And it'll get to all of us to know each other even that much better. And uh, whenever convention rolls around, we're just going to have that much more fun at convention, too. Because we all have had received a gift from somebody or another. So for those of that wants to participate. So anyway, I thought it'd be fun. Y'all on board? Okay. okay. Does anybody else have anything to add? Any questions, comments? I would just like to say that you and um, Deanna, I'm doing that right because I can totally call you Miss Clark and always say that right. But anyway, 
Um, I think it's awesome your 12 days of Christmas. So thanks again for spending time on that. That that's how Dina operates. She's just like she you need a graphic. Run. Call me, y'all. I can give. I can get. She should be our IT department at corporate. <laughs> That's what I've always suggested. So, but anyway, we'll leave it there. But uh, anybody else? It, Shanna, Shauna, you know, you know what your name is. You look like you want to say something. Unmute. <laughs> it's good, Jennifer. Go with that. <laughs> you poor thing. <laughs> uh, well, y'all, thank y'all so much for being on the call. I love all the energy and the excitement, and I hope that y'all feel it too. And I uh, I truly am here for y'all. I'm 100% committed, and I know Teresa and Amy are as well. And I know that the other leaders that I've talked to are as well. So uh, let us know if we can do anything to help y'all and cheering everybody on to an amazing uh, next, what, 11 days that we have left uh, of the triple points and then the rest of the month. So go out there. Don't leave anything on the table. The company's throwing money at us, so go get it. So have a great night. Thank y'all. Thank you. Good night.